Hi everyone, I'm Merrill Hodge, sitting in my favorite chair, doing my favorite thing, watching tape. We're gonna shift gears a little bit and we're gonna go on the offensive side of the ball. And we're gonna look at the passing game and the wide receivers. And look at the potential that the Steelers really have as far as um, a complete wide receiving core, explosive wide receiver core. And there's a lot of um, serious potential and, and good upside here for those perspectives. You know, Juju coming back after being hurt, you know, he's gonna be a difference maker. That's really, I know it's kind of a given. The explosive element of it and route running is the areas that make good wide receivers. And the Steelers have a couple of those guys. You know, James Washington is explosive. Uh, Deontay Johnson, to me, I loved him in college because of his ability to run routes, get separation, get in and out of breaks. Now we just gotta develop those things, make them better. Um, the first play that I really want to look at is when your quarterback makes great plays and an explosive opportunity, you got to compliment your quarterback. And here's a good example, first of all, of what Washington brings to the party is that he's explosive. Now, he's here at the bottom of the screen. He does a great job at the line of scrimmage, stacking the defender and winning. Now, that is what he does beautifully. And obviously Ben identifies it immediately and he throws an absolutely perfect rope. Now, the only problem with this play, you have an explosive play. They're not easy to get in the National Football League. Um, you want it the line of scrimmage. Your quarterback makes an unbelievable throw. Now from a wide receiver perspective, and these are things that wide receivers work on. Um, you make mistakes like this, you gotta stay in bounds. Um, keeping your feet staying in bounds. When you have two guys in a trail position in the National Football League, this does not happen very often that you get this situation. So you gotta take advantage of it. Um, it can't be just an explosive play, it's gotta be a touchdown. Okay, here's another play with Washington and an explosive play, an opportunity for a touchdown, not just a big play. Um, I keep making that reference. It's hard to get explosive plays in the NFL. It's even harder to get explosive touchdowns in the NFL. But when you have a receiver that has the explosive ability like Washington does here, you got to compliment him from the quarterback perspective. You got a guy in a trail position um, and he's won. Well, you got to you got to you got to put him away on this one. That right there in that trail position, safety is sat flat. Um, it can't just be an explosive play. It's gotta be a touchdown. Now, listen, right here, you have a quarterback, Mason Rudolph, that hasn't had a lot of experience. These are things that he will get so much better at, you know, as, as he evolves in his career. But when you get this positioning, really from a safety perspective, he's flat. This guy's in a trail. This right here, my friends, is not just an explosive play, which all that's all it ends up being. It's really got to be a touchdown. Uh, does a great job of coming back to get the football. But these are the things you work on in the offseason as you get better. Wide receiver and quarterback. Another aspect of this passing game that I love is Johnson's ability to run routes. Um, He's only going to get better and better, um, and that's going to help him help the passing game. And I think you'll see big strides in that coming next year. Um, he did a great job at the line of scrimmage, so let's take a look at him against the Buffalo Bills. Now, he's up at the top of the screen here where we want to focus, and he does a great job you know, at the line of scrimmage when he wins and using his hands. I want you to kind of watch how he uses his hands. I think that's often forgot about from a wide receiver perspective, you can use your hands, you can be physical. I mean, look at him slap and separate. That is just so important. Now he can stack the defender and get beyond him. And then quarterback, great job of making a great throw. Now they get the ball out here, they get it back, so no harm, no foul. But how he wins at the line of scrimmage, how he wins through his route, really love this about him. And his ability to run after the catch is outstanding. Uh, and he's gonna only get better. All right, here's another play. And the reason I like this play so much is it's third and eight. I mean, these are plays you gotta win in the National Football League and they're not, they're not easy. 
but good route runners win in situations like this. Now, Deontay Johnson, he's at the top of the, sc the screen. I want you to watch the top of his route, you know, how he ends up selling it and getting separation. I mean, that is so important. See, his, his ability to, it looks like you, if you stop it here that he's trying to make an in-breaking route. And he does a great job of getting the defender to commit to that to before he comes out of his break and goes back to the sideline. Um, that's just great discipline in route running. Um, that's a big time play, it's third and eight, and you get chunks of yards out of that. And he's only gonna get better and better at this. It's already something that he did really innately in college. That's what helped him transition um, so well. And this is only gonna get better. These type of plays, um, are devastating to defenses and your offensive coaches and players love these type of big time plays.